what's up guys Marky from VIP shop management I just want to give you a warning because that's been happening I think for the past uh, year and a half where uh, TechMetric, ShopMonkey and, and others those are the two main what, what they do is they hire people to call the shops daily every day m multiple times and uh, basically they're trying to get you to leave VIP and join the, their platform and making big promises and I saw it twice in my case where uh, where two customers they they were they they started with us a certain like one of them was at, at he started with us selling like thirties forties and then after like eight months he he got to the ninety thousand so he got in his head that uh, that you know if he switched to uh, to a different platform he's gonna make more money and the problem is uh, I think TechMetric in his case called him and pro made him all these promises and what happened is from 90s went back to the 40s and uh the problem why is that well first of all that you're talking to a salesman the salesman gonna tell you anything you want to hear so you got to be smarter than that you are a salesman so if a salesman comes at you and, and making the promises that doesn't make any sense if he guarantees the promises then i say it's like all right well let's guarantee it from the from the next let's let's look at where I'm at right now, and let's guarantee for the next 12 months. If I don't make, if I don't meet this, what are you gonna pay the difference? Or if I go down, are you gonna pay the difference? Or are you give me the, the software for, for free for the next 12 months? It's all BS, man. What what makes you what makes you busy or not busy? It depends on your location. We have customers in VIP that sell over five million. We have a lot of customers that sell over a million. Why they're selling over a million where somebody's selling over using the same platform and selling 500 or less. It depends on your location, your location, how much, how much, how much, what kind of car people drive around you, how much busy is it, how, what is the demand? It's all about the whole business, all demand, uh, supply and demand. That's all every business, how it is. If there's not much demand, you can use uh, uh, the latest software, it's not gonna help you. Not tech metric, not all data. But the problem is don't be the next victim. I've already seen it twice when somebody switch and have to come back to us because they waste. Now they're losing the half of their data or they have to pay for the transferring the data back just because some salesman so nice made him a promises that doesn't make any sense. Man, people, there's people selling in the millions and they're still handwriting receipts. How they're doing that? Because it doesn't matter. What matters is where their location at. Can you bring some traffic for the next 30 days? Force, do some coupons, crazy prices? Yes. And then they'll go away. You gotta be smarter than that. What you can do, the only thing you can do is for free is make sure your reviews on Google are the best. That's what drives people. People search is like, man, this guy has 45 reviews. Uh, more like they're all five stars. So people go to them. They'll drive the extra mile. However, that's not going to be your customer all the time because he got to drive the extra mile. He, uh, people like they're, they're lazy and they want what's convenient for them. They're not going to drive 10 miles. And if they did it, they'll do it once and twice and they'll stop in the end. They can't do it. They're busy. They have stuff to do. So don't fall in these traps and don't, don't let somebody from Shop Monkey it's nice and cute and sounds so awesome and he wants your, your best interest. Why would he want? He doesn't even know you. Why would he want your best interest? He doesn't. What he wants is to make sales so he can get paid. Anyway, let me show you something with VIP before I go. So we added a uh, couple things I want to talk about. So up top, you can click and print the day, all the appointments, uh, So which is pretty cool. Uh, let me just move myself real quick. Another thing is when you delete it, uh, people were deleting it by mistake. You see we have the trash right there. It was so easy. Now if you click on it, and you gotta click confirm or cancel in case you don't want to delete it because people were thinking it said an X basically. Um, another thing that we did is when you add an appointment and say all change and type the phone number and it's gonna list the name and the cars for the customer. You see that all the cars you have to do, you, what you do is you pick the car. Uh, if you made a mistake, just click on change vehicle and, and pick the car. If, if it's a new car, just click on add a new vehicle, type in the license plate and press enter. And it's simple as that and then it will add it automatically so. And just click add. So it's really simple and it's really, it's made this appointments man, it's made for, for, uh, 
for auto repair shop to make it easy and so I, I designed this based on experience not based on what Google has and not based on what anybody has based on experience when somebody was on the phone I needed his phone number first when I when I need his phone number I want to know is he an existing customer or not if it's an existing customer because the majority of people are calling you are existing customers so if it's an existing customer then we need to know uh, what, what which car is he bringing a new car is it this car all this stuff anyway appreciate you guys until next time thanks for watching